Dorian, people living in Volusia County, they're watching and some of them are really worried. Their homes were flooded two years ago during Hurricane Irma and those houses were supposed to be raised on stilts to prevent them from flooding again, but that didn't happen. Reporter Eric Standoval is finding out why. Volusia County Emergency Services tells me the state of Florida actually rejected their application to put these homes up on stilts. They said they needed more proof that the neighborhood was going to flood again. So tonight the people who live there say they're waiting for the worst. Bruce Chiarizzi says he and his wife are dreading Hurricane Dorian. I'm panicking. I'm really panicking. We first met the couple last year. That's when they shared this video showing the floodwaters Hurricane Irma sent into their home in 2017. 14 and a half inches from the overflowing Tomoka River. Had no regard for all that. It just came up, came in, and we had no, uh, no chance. Volusia County Emergency Management stepped in to apply for federal money. They wanted to use it to elevate the Chiarizzi's home and some of their neighbors' homes on stilts, like this one across the street. Chiarizzi says he was hoping the solution would be here by now. But we found out inspectors at the state level kicked it back, asking the county to conduct more studies on the river, studies that will require the county to buy their own river gauges. The Chiarizzi say they're left watching Dorian hoping the floodwaters stay away. I trust and believe that they will do it. I just don't know when. And I don't know how long we can hold out here. Now, Chia Rizzi says that he has flood insurance to cover the contents of his home, and that is a good thing. Emergency Services says that they're going to be resubmitting the application to get these homes up off the ground in hopes of getting those neighbors some results. We're in Volusia County tonight. Eric Sandoval, Channel 4, The Local Station.